did you go? Hey, stop it! Sis, why is your head in here backwards, <laughs> sissy? Hey, stop it! Stop! Y'all, it's Saturday, and we have a very busy day ahead of us. I thought I'd bring you along with me. Let's get going. Everyone's hungry. It's kind of harmonious this morning in a strange way. I don't typically feed in the mornings, but uh, I want to switch jobs now because it's my, well, except for y'all. Okay, okay, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'll still come at night. Oh my goodness. Poor Aunt Lydia. Well, I'm kidding, I guess. I guess I'll do both. All right, next up are pigs. Ernie, we don't usually do waters in the morning, baby. But I will, because you're here. I know, everyone is so confused about what I'm doing out here. They're like, uh, mom doesn't usually come out first thing, so what is happening? Sorry, Ernie. Even these guys are like, what, what day is it? Why are you here? Oh no. Sissy, why would you do that? Why did you go, hey, stop it. Sis, why is your head in here backwards, <laughs> sissy? Hey, stop it! Stop! Oh, I had my hand on her horns ready to pull her through. You two leave her alone. Get out of the way, Lenny! Move. Sis, I had to put the camera down, okay? Come on. Sissy, why would you do that? Turn your head. Oh, this is the dumbest thing you've done in a while. Hold on. Okay. Woo. Go around. Come on. Come this way. Come on, weirdo. Okay, so that whole, like, it's so serene and peaceful in the morning. That's over. That's gone. Everybody's still got the devil in them. Don't worry. We're still a shit show. All right, I'm gonna clean out some of these waters because they did get really gross last night, Ernie. Thank you for telling me. Yeah, I blame y'all. And I gotta do the bigs. Yeah, so these guys like it when it takes me too long to go back and forth between horse buckets because the water overflows and they think that this is the greatest day on earth. Oh, babies. You're never gonna have grass. Good morning, sir. Would you like breakfast? A little Saturday brunch? Be good to me. Do not be naughty. No, Ivy, that's not where you go. Oh boy. Ivy, he's gonna kick you out. Hold on, Danny, I'm coming. Told you he was gonna kick you out of your place. Little pony, get in with the donkeys. Hey, Hank. Good boys. Ivy, go in with... I'm sorry that you have to share, baby. Oh my gosh, Bucky's and Voodoo stalls are hard. Ivy, Voodoo doesn't share. He's just like Joey. He doesn't share food. I guess he does. Her face. Definitely in there. Come on. <laughs> not just go to everybody else's house to eat, dear. I guess you can. Uh, Hi, Dan. Come on, baby. I gotta close the gate. You can have a little nibble while I close it. Somebody made a mess in here. Was it you? We gotta clean that up today, buddy. We have a lot of chores to do, actually. We can't be messing around here for too long. Come on. I'll put it in a bowl for you. Come with me. Come on, Dan. Fritzy, where's the cows at? They out back already? I see no cows. 
it makes me a little bit nervous because oh wait i do i see text laying down okay Whew. maggie where are the rest of the cows tex I don't have the amazing cow call that the Maros do. That's that has not come to me yet. Tex, let's go! Oh look! My calling tactics worked. We got more guests in the back. Tex doesn't mind that I have a little bit of a janky cow call. It's okay. Still works, right? Still brought food. Move out of your way. How do you feel about that? Uh huh. Yeah. He doesn't care about my janky cattle call. Still brought food. We're still friends. Still in good graces here. Right, buddy? Thank you for that. I, uh, I see Moo out back. So that's helpful. I am. Um, I'm gonna go grab some more food and bring it out to the girls and moo and then I can be done with this part of the tours this morning. Don't look so excited about that Tex. You get to eat alone. I put the horses up, the donkeys up, and Donkey Dan's not gonna bother you. You get to have Saturday brunch in solace. Hey Carl. 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 Hey I left you breakfast up there over at the uh the front. Aren't you hungry? You kind of look lonely, which makes me sad. Even though I know you don't want me to visit, I bet. I bet you'd welcome Debbie visiting. Debbie, why are you hiding your legs like that? You're all like tucked in, like you're nervous. I'm walking around like an old lady who's like holding her hands underneath her shawl. Oh. No, nope. thank you for that. That was a little hat tip, I felt. Okay, you just had chilly legs this morning. I get it, I do that too. Why don't you go hang out with Carl for a little bit? He needs love. He does, he needs some friends and just companionship through this. I know you do it too. Oh, thank you for the curtsy. I appreciate it. Could you just go give Carl a little peck on the cheek and Tell him you love him, perhaps. How do you feel about that? No? Okay, well I got work to do. I still gotta go get some stuff for the cows. I'm sorry, I can't hang out today. It's very busy. Dad and Jake went to Longhorn Lester's and... They... Debbie, Debbie, not me on the cheek. Carl, go kiss Carl on the cheek. Debbie, Carl needs it, not me. Debbie, no baby. All right, really, I got work to do. I love you. Be a good girl today. Would you like to come inside? Would you like a late breakfast, Gracie? Would you like some breakfast, baby? Hi, Pearl friend. Come on, babies. Don't quit on me now, Maggie. Don't quit on me now. This is when you know things are out of whack. Pablo? You helped me with nothing today. You've been waiting here on the porch thinking that I'm still in bed. It's way too late to still be in bed. Just cause I'm not dad. Wait, who left their cup on the porch, Pablo? Did you do that too? And the door open. Boy, we're off to a great start. Super great. 